What's up, Amy Thick and Curly here. If you have been following me for any amount of time or if you know me personally, you know that your girl will rock a red lip. Morning, noon, night, doesn't matter what occasion. Literally, red lips are my absolute fave. I will wear every other color but red. I grew up with my mom wearing red. I absolutely love a red lip, a bold red lip at that. So I was purchasing this newer one. This is the NYX. Uh, NYX lingerie. This color is the uh, stamina. I was purchasing this the other day and I was like, oh my God, why not do a try on haul with a couple of others? Uh, the OG and then my current fave. Let's just try them out. So I wanted to do a video. I'm going to show you guys. Like I said, the lip bar is currently my favorite. I think this is Hot Mama. Yep. The lip bar, Hot Mom. You guys know Hot Mama, excuse me. The lip bar is a black owned, cruelty free company. And then Y'all, if you wear red lips, Ruby Woo, baby, from MAC. You already know. And then this newer one, like I said, is NYX. So we're just going to try them on. My lips are bare. I'm not going to do a liner. And we're just going to see what they look like. And then I'm going to tell you guys my favorite. All right, so as you can see, I started off in real time just so you can see how it glides on. Again, this is Ruby Woo. Um, MAC, this one is a little bit dry. This is one of the few MACs that I still wear. It's a little bit dry. It doesn't glide on like I would like it to. And it doesn't always feel in my inner lips. So I'll go like this and blow a kiss. You can see it. I purposely didn't put any liner on because I didn't want any other color manipulating it. Took my glasses off, sorry about the glare. All right, this is the lip bar. So you can see that one is more of a lipstick. This one, do they call it a, they don't call it a gloss, I know. I'll put here, whatever they call it, but it's wetter and it has this application stick versus it being in a tube. And it's super wet, like it gets on my teeth often, often. because it's wet but now you're just gonna let it dry once this one dries it's on for the day even when I scrub my lips at night to get it off my lips I have very white lips very pale lips my lips remain a pink tint like to the next day it this this stuff is going to stain your lip in the best way it's light, fluffy, velvety. I really love it. All right, so I am super excited to try this one. You guys can see the seal. There's the seal. So you guys are seeing me open this for the first time on camera. I made sure I didn't even touch it until I was up here with you guys. This is the new NYX. I don't even know if it's new. I just thought about that. Maybe it's new to me, child. Um, NYX, and this color is stamina. They had a couple of reds, but this appeared to be the one that's most like me. So here goes the application stick. Has a good amount on the brush. Let's try it out, see what it does. Oh goodness. This one is creamy. Oh God. Oh God. This is my new favorite. Okay, so I'm gonna let this one dry while I'm talking. So far, it's kind of amazing. Okay, this one, my current fave, is very light and feathery and goes on like velvet. Um, it can dry a little bit hard, but not as hard as the Ruby Woo. This one just went on like a cream, like buttery, velvety versus, versus buttery. So let's see how it dries. Okay, so this one is now dry, and just being completely honest, I'm probably gonna love and rotate between these two. Ruby Woo, because it's such a classic, I've always loved it. However, it just goes on kind of drier than I would prefer. It feels very like crayon-like. 
going on. Um, still has a beautiful smell, but just a little bit drier than I would prefer. And I noticed that throughout the day with Ruby Woo, it will kind of cake up in certain spots, and I never have that problem with this one. So I'm more than likely going to retire the Ruby Woo after the current two. I have a regular and a travel size Ruby Woo, and these are probably going to be in rotation together. Velvety, buttery, I love them both. Let me wear this for a day and see if it clumps or cakes or anything, but if it stays like it is right now, it's definitely a win. A little bit stickier than this one. However, let me wear it for a day. So I might come back at the very end of the day. Try them out, let me know what you think. Let me know what's your favorite red lip. If you are a girl like me who loves her a red lip, which one's your favorite? Let me know below. Love you guys so much. Peace and blessings, thick and curly. Stay tuned for my next video with this uh, faux lock DIY ponytail. You snap it in and out. Also, be sure to follow me on all social media at Thick and Curly and on TikTok, Coach BST. Peace, guys.